what's going on guys this is nams and i'm back today with another video on the cls 63 amg this will be the final part for this car now there's three reasons why i'm making this video the first one is to offer you guys a chance to buy this car from me i have seen a few comments in the last few videos of people saying i would like to buy this car after all i bought this car for youtube and to make content for it so it only makes sense to offer it back to you guys first before i put it up on the market right secondly i'll do a quick review of the car and what i think of it third of all if you do want to buy the car on finance i can offer that from my company as well i'll give you the finance breakdown with the monthly payments before we get into any of that this video is sponsored by car vertical they are a comprehensive car check service and i'm going to show you what their check includes all right let's punch in my registration and let's have a look yep go for a full check now it's checking all the national registries law enforcement workshops dealer data even car marketplaces it's really looking deep inside in every single place so i've viewed the report mileage is good theft it's not been stolen it's never had an accident it's got no finance outstanding on it now let's have a look at a car that has got problems got bmw m4 here on the search and it's pulled up with the accident fault um as you can see it shows you exactly where it had the damage what country it was in this is what i find interesting it's done a search in all of these countries it's a full international search it's checked for fire damage flood damage collisions import again evaluation specs engine code and whatnot this here is the best part it actually pulled up pictures from the accident itself so you can actually see how the car looked before it was repaired which is just amazing now if you scroll down more we got some pictures from what it looks like when it was in Copart for sale, as you can see, fully fixed up. I've got to say, I'm definitely impressed with the search Car Vertical has pulled up. So yeah, that's a full car check done by Car Vertical. As you saw, this car is completely clean in every single way. It's been checked in so many countries. Um, it's there, you've seen the video, it's all clear. Um, so you got a peace of mind that this car is hitched back clear, never been in an accident or anything like that. Let's start off by talking about the engine. built V8 5.5 litre bi-turbo it's the M157 engine and it's a proper beast as you can see it's very very clean freshly rebuilt the stock figures on this is 560 bhp and 720 newton meters of torque 0 to 60 in 4.1 seconds which is rapid for a rear wheel driven vehicle it's got a lot of power sounds amazing um, originally you had the CC3 which was a 6.2 litre V8 this is like them coming down on displacement to a 5.5 and then they come down to a 4 litre twin turbo and next is a 2 litre so these are a dying breed yeah. you want to get hold of these cars before they start running out before and the electrics take over before the electrics take over man sure. yeah but I mean if you come around look at this car it's a beautiful car look at the wheels from Wahana it just looks so amazing in person do you know what I love about this car if you come to the back look at that set up with the seat it's a full seater but look at that centre bit, I love it how you just separate it out. It's got the armrest as well. It's got a sunroof, IWC clock, lever on the dashboard. Bro, it's so classy. It's like it's classy, yeah, it's black it. and, and the chrome accents like the silver. You know accent. one thing I didn't realise before as well? Look at this, the roof. Alcantara roof. Oh. When you when it's in the garage, you don't realize you don't realise this stuff. You just yeah, keep yeah, busy yeah. building the car back up. Exactly, exactly. Trust me, man. No, now this is built, beautiful. I've taken it out, I actually appreciate what it is. Uh, what year is this car? What year is this? 14 plate. 14 plate. Look at this, it's got memory seats. It's got the adjustment settings from the door, which is quite classy as well. Panel shifters. Top Lev spec, man. Yeah, man, leather on the dashboard. Harman Kardon speakers. I'm just looking for spec right now. Yeah, trust me, man. And it's got leather, it's got leather everywhere as well. Everywhere. Let's open this up. That's nice as well, it's got the connecti connectivity. Yeah. Yeah, what, what does these buttons do? That's like, I think, for the bolster. Oh, for the bolster. Tighten it up and stuff. For this thing is well, let's go, man. Shall we turn eco mode off? Yeah, turn that off. <laughs> <laughs> what does that do? Hold on, oh, let me press it. Oh, it's got rear blinds. Oh. <laughs> That's nice, man. That must be additional extra, it must oh, be. This has got fully loaded with all the options. more than 560 bhp yeah 
Yeah. It's all that talk, isn't it, man? Yeah, and it's so tail happy as well. I mean, not that bad. You, can, you know, you, you need to know how to handle it. It's very nice to say. Yeah, Ooh. It's very comfortable as well, you know. Yeah, you know, it's I love doing it. I love throwing it on the sides. On the side. <laughs> Flip, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and it's in a circuit, man. <laughs> oh my god, if no one buys this, I'm telling them to take this to the Nurburgring, bro. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is nice as the Nurburgring. Trust me. Flip, now I feel like keeping this car now. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time I'm driving it properly. So, how much are you selling the car for, Nams? So, the retail value on the car currently is £31,000. Okay. That's how much I'm selling it for. As I said before, I can offer you finance on the car as well. So, Nams, man, I know I want you to keep this car, but you're definitely going to sell it. What are you making room for, man? What's the next project? Tell us. So, as you guys know, I bought this car purely for content on YouTube, just like I did for the Range Rover. So, that's why I'm selling this to make room for another one. And the next one's going to be an interesting one. I've already bought the car. So it should hopefully be here in the next one to two weeks and I'll show you guys what it is. I'd rather show you than just tell you now. Oh, you already got it? I already bought it. Oh, yeah. okay, all right. Yeah. No I'll have to be active for this stuff. All right, say no more, say no more. There seems to be a big audience in YouTube for this kind of content where the car's not running or it's got loads of problems. I enjoy buying cars like that, doing it up and selling it and at the same time, you guys love watching it. So that's what, that's what my content's going to be mainly about other than obviously showing you what else we do in the garage as well. Okay. I'll boost performance. Yo, yeah. Nams, man, I think people are trying to see some vlogs, bro. When are the vlogs coming? Daily vlogs? Day in the life of Nams? That's a good question. Yeah. Um, day in the life of Nams, um, other vlogs, like going to holidays. Yeah, yeah, We're going yeah. to Nürburgring in two, three weeks, I think it is. We'll be vlogging that as well. Look out for that. There's going to be loads more content as time comes, so... Sweet, man. It's good, then it? It's going to be an exciting summer. Yeah, man. I mean, summer's nearly finished now. Summer's nearly make, finished, Make yeah. the most of the last parts, isn't it? Exactly, exactly, exactly. So, to wrap up this video, I'm going to show you a few of my cars in stock in Sterling Motor Group and I'll show you another car that you guys might be interested in buying. It's more family friendly, so yeah, let me just jump out of this car. Yo, it's rammed in the garage, man. Okay. It's rammed in there, bro. What? It's rammed in it. Oh, you rammed some food. You got sandwich, yeah, G. You got sandwiches all over. There, yeah. cars. Yeah, we've got quite a few things going on here. We've got the M6 in there. Yeah. Camshaft issues. Some of my car sales cars. By the way, this is the stuff that don't make onto YouTube. These kind of cars. I don't think you guys want to see that. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you do, because I don't mind buying these cars as well. Yeah, trust. We've got a D63 in there. What's that uh, info, bro? That, um, that, I'm going to make separate content for it, so okay. you guys will see what that's for as well. Sweet. It's a very nice edition 30. We've had engine rebuild, complete engine rebuild. Yeah. This yeah. one's done now, isn't it? Yeah, look how rammed up it is. We've got another ramp right back. I can't see it. There's a villa in there for rebuild as well. That like Golf R has been a lot done as well, hasn't it? Yeah, it's a lot of things he's done to it. Yeah. Stage 2, damp pipes, quite, quite a few things. Yeah. And that's a wrap on the CLS 63 AMG. Another time to show you the other car I wanted to show you. BMW 5 Series M Sport. It's an estate model. You don't see much of these on the road. I know the car's a little dirty. Right, but look, very, very nice. 5 Series M Sport. The colour is carbon black. Let's open the door and show you guys. It's got black wheels as well. Very different. Have a look at the interior. Very nice indeed. I thought while I'm at the subject of showing you the CLS and the values of it and whatnot, and if you want to buy it, I thought I'll show you something a bit different as well. Look at that. The glass pops up. Very nice and useful when you want to access just the boot. I know the car's a little dirty, but just show you the car. If anyone's interested, you can give me a shout. You can also obviously pop the boot like that. There you go. Massive boot. The seats drop down, making the boot even bigger, all the way up to the front passenger seats. That is a stunning, stunning car. It's a 67 plate, 52k on the block. M Sport wheels there. Two different beasts. 2 litre diesel, 5.5 litre petrol. I really do like the interior as well. Look at that wood interior. Very nice. The screen there is massive as well. Let me show you the sat nav. Look at that screen. That is massive. It's a diesel as well. Very, very economical. I've got about 550 miles on a tank. 
which is a lot now this fire series here is up for 23 and a half it is hewless compliant being a 67 plate yeah man other than a good car wash it doesn't need anything else oh i forgot to say it's got full bmw service history as well look at this very nice place to be in i've actually been dailying this for a while now purely because of how economical it is and how nice it is to drive as a daily it's got leather on the it's got leather on the steering on the airbag as well uh, it's even got leather on the dashboard for a fast series saloon not bad at all is it yeah, look. it's got the Harman Kardon speakers that's about it really I'm not gonna go too much into the sales stuff today this was mainly about the CLS showing you the car and making one last video of it the company that I sell my cars through is called Sterling Motor Group we currently have 30 cars in stock and we're only increasing stock as we go I'll soon make a video of just my car sales business and I'll show you daily operations and what it takes to run a business like this alongside with performance of course I forgot to mention also if you are interested in buying this fire series it is VAT qualifying which means if you buy it through your business you can claim the VAT back on it so at 23 and a half it's 20 percent off the vehicle for a used car it's very hard to find VAT qualifying vehicles so that's a massive bonus other than that guys I think I'm gonna wrap the video up here thanks again for watching another video this is Nams from Boost Performance I'm looking forward to showing you guys the next project after the CLS so guys look out for more content stay tuned like this video drop me a comment and if you're new subscribe to my channel and don't forget to follow me on Instagram it's in the description below see you later